Hey everybody, Lorraine here. So, a lot of people have been experimenting with the DecoArt Extreme Sheen Gold and other colors. And we know that that gives us these beautiful, shiny, cloudy looking effects. Today, I'm going to see what happens when we take that the gold extreme sheen along with some color shift colors. So I have an 11 by 14 inch canvas and I'm going to do a straight pour and start out with my white. I'll put in some of the gold. I have a, um, a burgundy that I mixed up here. I'm going to use that along with it. And that will be my only um, non-iridescent or metallic paint. Tiny bit of this purple flash left. Put that in there. Tiny bit of the green flash. Um, put a little more white in. Oops. Put in some more of the magenta or um, burgundy that I mixed up. I have a blue purple flash. Put that in there. Finish that off. And then this is a pink flash, even though it looks very orange. Put that in. A little more of my gold. bit more of this berry. I'll just use that up here. I also have some pearl I'm going to put in. So these are all iridescent and metallic paints except for the white and the burgundy. Top it off with white. Use this up. Oh, why not? Let's put some more gold in there. We'll put the rest of this in there. Just use these up. Why not? Hopefully I don't come up with just a big gold blob. So I'm going to do just a straight pour. Make sure that you're Okay, and here comes the white on the bottom. I'm 
Okay. Well, there's a lot of burgundy. So let's move it around and see what happens. I just have no idea if those color shifts are even going to show up in here. Maybe they will, maybe they won't. I'm seeing them a little bit. I'm going to grab something to catch my corners with here. So I'm just going to go right up to this corner and bring it back. Bring it down to this one. Bring it back. Adjust where my paint is. Wow, that looks really pretty right there. Hit this corner. Back down. And last but not least, we're going to get this one. some of the poofies over here. I'm going to give it a torch to get rid of the air bubbles. Seeing very little of the, um, the color shift paints. See a little bit of it in here. The gold is definitely coming up through. It's very berry, though. I like it all. I'm trying to decide because I know there's a lot of paint on the canvas. And I have to get rid of some of it. I think I'll get rid of some over here. Because that kind of looks... Eh. <laughs> Not so sure about that. Really like these lines here. Stretching these cells out a little funny. I don't like that too much. Hopefully I can dump some off and then bring those back. Hmm. 
Okay, kind of like that. I like the way the lines are coming in this way and they're falling this way. Give it another torch. Very pretty. I'm definitely not seeing any of the color shift right now. Very little of the green here. I see a little blob of something right there. Get that out. Okay guys, I will come back when this is dry. And we'll see what it looks like then. Thanks for visiting with me. I appreciate it. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Like and share my videos if you would. Give you a close-up of... Uh, different areas here. It's very pretty. I do expect it to change a little bit with the gold in there. Gold tends to kind of grow a little bit. I like the center. It's really neat in the center there. Alright guys, thanks for visiting with me. Appreciate it.